Hi there, this is Team Tsunami and this video is related to our project Early Landslide Warning System. Landslides each year causes a massive loss of life and property. To tackle this problem, our government is investing a lot in the early detection system, such as government with the help of IIT Roorkee faculty has installed sensors in the landslide prone areas of Uttarakhand. But the cost of each sensor is around 84,000 and maintenance cost each year is 16,000 per sensor. So through this CFD project, we are proposing a cost-effective IoT solution where each node has three sensors, rain gauge, soil moisture, accelerometer, which are connected to Arduino and the total cost of each node is around 1000. So these nodes can be installed in large quantity and a cluster of 10 nodes would be communicating with the central Raspberry Pi which runs a service for sending the data to IoT Hub which routes the payload to the Azure function for further processing. The serverless function has a job of calculating risk factor, sending alerts and saving data in the Cosmos DB for further analysis. Now for delivering analytical reports and warning to monitoring agencies and users, we have a REST API which provides real-time data from the sensors. We also have a dashboard which can be used by government for monitoring the areas and an app powered by our infrastructure for getting notifications about the same. So now let's get started with the demo. Here we try to create a landslide scenario where due to heavy rainfall, soil has loosened and land has started moving which is detected by the accelerometer. Then these readings are sent to Azure function via IoT hub and in the console we can see that the data is coming and it is real time as the values are changing. After that these readings are stored in Cosmo DB and in the data explorer for Cosmo DB we can see that the readings have a risk factor of 0.5 or higher values which indicate a critical situation. We also have a dashboard which is powered by the REST API which can be used for analysis and for the sensor 5, we can see that the values are changing quite drastically which could indicate a disaster like situation. The color of the surrounding region for that sensor has also turned red and in the graph we can see that the yellow line is showing a spike. We also have an android app which is capable of showing the heat map of the landslide activities and the risk factor for the surrounding regions. For regions that are far away, it is zero. And for closer regions, it is showing a higher value. By doing this project, we try to create an ecosystem for landslide detection and providing early warnings, which could prove beneficial in saving human lives. Thank you.